trying to clean up all of these tools that I got from this estate sale. Kind of gone through everything that was here, separated a little bit, cleaned it up a little bit. Uh, some of it was junk. I just threw away what really wasn't good and kind of kept and separated what was good. I did actually have a friend of mine ask me about all of those cordless Ryobi tools that I did get in there and I ended up trading him a scrap Volkswagen VR6 and actually made a little bit more money trading the car and scrapping the car than I would have if I just sold out the tools plus he got to have the tools and he can use those so I was kind of happy about that. I like to wheel and deal. I like to barter trading. Um, sometimes it works out better for me. Sometimes it works out better for both of us. And in this situation, that's exactly what happened is it worked out better for both of us. Now, just at the shop, I basically kind of cleared out everything and separated it all. And I'll show you what I all found. So I'll start here at the end. First, what we have, all sorts of nail guns. We got pass load we have some finished nailers we got all bosch ditch nailers here which are all going to be staple guns and uh trim nailers roofing guns um i literally found a bunch of caulking guns we have breaker bars we have uh some decent hammers even got a cat's paw here a bunch of hand tools that i all separated here we got sharps we got screwdrivers everything from players all that um, found a couple decent milwaukee tape measures got a couple older stanley ones paint scrapers we got drywall tools here a couple of saws some trowels uh even some paint thinner swivel hooks we have all sorts of fasteners here these are all going to be nails um, we even have some concrete shanks found some drill bits for a hammer drill halfway decent mixers i'll clean those up extension cords we got all sorts of paint gear some of the rollers again i'll have to just throw away and replace but everything seems to be in good working order i did find a few levels uh, we'll go over here. We have all sorts of bit kits and screwdriver heads, socket heads. We have all sorts of stuff here. Underneath, we have a brand new storage container that was never actually used. In the back, we got a brand new box, you know, a carry tote. We got a nice Milwaukee pack out kit, and we got another. Uh, master force one that has uh, a bunch of hand tools in it as well some bits some heads nice hammer we got an old black and decker drill tent stakes um got some speed squares uh even a set of files a bunch of random stuff um i mean even including starter strip for a roof uh that air compressor is brand new brand new hoses uh the hose actually was never even taken apart from its factory condition there uh makita got a few sanders here a nice jigsaw and then we can go into here these are all fasteners everything from nails we have a full bag of screws longer shank screws um and then if we go up to here again this is all miscellaneous fasteners uh screws we got duct tape we got some pvc glue even have some ultima i mean that stuff's like nine bucks a tube so i'm happy with that and something that i use quite a bit are these finish screws and We got a whole entire container here. Nice star bit heads. Leaf blower, we have some more containers, some buckets, and then I have a bunch of gutter pieces here to 
help hold and connect, but everything went pretty well. And now I'm going to figure out what I'm going to keep and what I'm going to sell.